Hey YouTube, GR here. I promised you guys I'd get back to you with a Ruger SR22 follow-up, basically like the outro of this uh, video series. So, you can see some cleaning supplies scattered around the table. I haven't cleaned it since I got the gun. Uh, when I did get it, I, you know, disassembled to clean it. The normal, uh, you know, the normal MO for getting a new gun. Now, about 700 rounds in, I'm finally starting to have a little bit of an issue with, uh, with well, I don't want to say an issue. It's 700 rounds in. Haven't cleaned it in 700 rounds. And I'm starting to get some failure to feeds, but only if I uh, drop the slide by using the uh, slide release. As in, like, okay, you know, shoot through all the rounds in a magazine, slide locks back, put a new magazine in, drop the slide with the uh, the thumb by not, you know, just use my thumb and not slingshot it forward, then it'll uh, feed maybe like, you know, 75% of the way and then get hung up on probably the ginormous dirt ring that's in the barrel. So, uh, super pleased with this gun. Um, the figure of feeds, if I did slingshot it, it would uh, it works no problem. If I just fire it normally, it works no problem. It's only if I go to drop the uh, slide with uh, the, thumb re the thumb release. So, awesome gun. I definitely recommend getting it. Uh, it's a, it's a fucking, it's just a blast to shoot, <laughs> literally. Um, the Stinger ammo through it is freaking fun as all hell. It's, like I said, a nice big fireball. Um, I just cleaned it, I just oiled it. I was going to do a video of uh, cleaning it and lubing it, but, you know, it ended up being like 30 fucking minutes, and it was just, uh, it was debauchery. You know, there's nothing wrong with cleaning it. It's easy to clean. It's just, you know, I'm kind of, I don't know, you know, here we go with the gay jokes, anal about, uh, cleaning. So, uh, you know, it, uh, it was dirty. It was definitely dirty. I fired some dirty-ass ammo through it. Um, otherwise, no issues. Uh, I had one failure to extract out of, uh, 700 rounds with a CCI, uh, standard pressure, standard velocity? Yeah, I think it was standard velocity. Maybe it was, no, it, yeah, anyway. It, it never happened again. It was a, it was a dud round. It wasn't able to, uh, didn't have a lot of power in it. So, otherwise, the gun has been, uh, just freaking amazing. I would definitely, definitely, definitely pick one up if you want to save some money, go out, have some fun. You know, and also, like I said, it's, uh, when it comes to, uh, you know, shit hits the fan, um, WROL situations, you could carry a lot of ammo, um, and this thing shoots anything. You know, it shoots any twenty two you could find. So, well, not twenty two Magnum, which, uh, I might have a little surprise considering twenty two Magnum, Magnum for you guys. Um, but, uh, like I said, maybe, it, maybe a viable, uh, you know, self-defense weapon in a, uh, in a shit-hits-the-fan scenario. Like, you could carry a lot of ammo, man. It's a lot of ammo. Um, <clears throat> and it's reliable. That's, that's the thing. That's the whole hitch with the twenty two long rifle pistols. It's automatics. You know, you can't find one that is, uh, A, reliable, B, that feeds anything, you know, C, that's, uh, you know, uh, stylish and easy to break down. So this, this seems that Ruger hit one. Ruger just knocked it out of the park, dude. That's all there is to say about it. I love the gun. It's, uh, it's definitely, it's my baby. It's my new baby. I like it. Get one. Um, I'm going to have, uh, at the end of this, well, you know, I'm going to put in some shooting, uh, videos. Shooting videos? Yeah. Some clips of me shooting the weapon, um, tagged into this video as well. So, uh, you get to see some, uh, of me, uh, popping some, uh, some steel, which, uh, got me in trouble, kind of, maybe a little bit. And, uh. Also, just uh, weapon firing a couple times, but otherwise, it's been um, it's been a nice piece. Like I said, it's uh, just test the tech, just testing out the camera there, seeing how it does with the close-up stuff. It is uh, safety check, just so you got fucking gun Nazis now. You know, I didn't safety check it 900 times in front of the camera. Give you a little sight picture here. Let's see if I could get that going. Nice sight picture. So, all right, guys, that's about it. Like I said, uh, cleaned it with some hoppies, some rem oil, some uh, lubed it up with a mixture of my own uh, that I make. Uh, you see that? Uh, that's a hair dye bottle because I'm, uh, yeah, I'm a vagina. So uh, that's a mixture of like mobile one synthetic with a little bit of uh, Marvel mystery in there. And, uh, you know, cleaned it. It was dirty. And, uh, now it's good to go. So, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, put some clips in here. 
and uh, let you see the weapon firing. And uh, if you guys have any questions, any comments about the weapon, just let me know. Send me a message. Um, the barrel has not become loose, like the, some of the problems, of, uh, very rare problems that they've had on the forums. But my barrel is, uh, has not become loose at all. 700 rounds. The gun's great. Accurate. Reliable. Eats anything. Shoots anything from standard pressure to high velocity, which is also a problem with some of the little 22s. They don't want to eat the high velocity because they'll just fall apart. Um, so I would definitely, uh, I know I said this like 500 times in the video, but I would definitely get one. All right, guys, I will, uh, you know, let you watch some of these videos and we'll catch up with you in a bit. GR out. All right, guys, you have to forgive the sway here, but we are up close and uh, personal. This is like, I don't know, uh, maybe seven yards. We got some little steel plates up there. I want to try to uh, knock these down. Let's give it a whirl, see what happens. Using CCI Stinger, Ruger SR-22. Let's see. Ooh, look at that go. Hmm, the little one's causing me issues. Doing a mag swap. Yeah. <clears throat> Wrong mag. <laughs> Alright. Let's go up top to the right. Very nice. Gun is definitely accurate. Definitely accurate. If I missed it, it was me.